Welcome back to Legendary Tributes. Rebecca Catherine Barrett was an American-born Canadian politician. She served as a member of the Legislative Assembly of Manitoba from 1990 to 2003 and was a cabinet minister in the New Democratic Party government of Gary Dewar from 1999 to 2003. She died on January 26th at age 81. Dean Brown was an American jazz fusion guitarist and session musician. He died on January 26th at age 68. Gordon Rogoff was an American theater director, dramaturge, professor, and theater critic. Rogoff died on January 26th at age 92. Michael Watford was an American dance music singer who was born in Virginia and raised in New Jersey. He was best known for his gospel-influenced vocals on house records throughout the 1990s and 2000s. Watford died on January 26 at age 80. Paul Angelo Valoni was an American politician and attorney from the state of New York. A Democrat, Valoni represented the 19th District on the New York City Council from 2014 to 2021. The district was located in Northeast Queens. He later served as the Deputy Commissioner of External Affairs for the New York City Department of Veterans Services. He died on January 27th at age 56. Marie Mansfield was an American pitcher who played from 1950 through 1954 in the All-American Girls Professional Baseball League. Listed at 5'7", 140 pounds, she batted and threw right-handed. Mansfield died in Lowell, Massachusetts on January 28th at age 92. Irma L. Anderson was an American politician who was the elected mayor of the city of Richmond, California, serving between 2001 and 2006. She ran for re-election as the incumbent Democrat in the 2006 mayoral race and lost to Green Party challenger Councilperson Gail McLaughlin by 192 votes. She died on January 28th at age 93. Donald Edward Cheeks was an American politician. He was a member of the Georgia State Senate from the 23rd District from 1992 to 2004. He was a member of the Republican Party. Cheeks also served in the Georgia House of Representatives from 1967 to 1968, District 104, 1971 to 1972, District 78, and 1979 to 1992, District 89. Cheeks died on January 28th at age 92. James Sebesta was an American politician. He served as a Republican member of the Florida Senate from 1998 to 2006. He previously served as Hillsborough County Supervisor of Elections from 1970 to 1974. He died on January 29th at age 88. Hal Buell was an American photographer who was the head of the photography service at the Associated Press for 25 years, where he supervised an international staff of 300 photographers. He was also the author of Moments, the Pulitzer Prize-winning Photographs and Uncommon Valor, Common Virtue, a book about war photographer Joe Rosenthal. Buell died of pneumonia in Sunnyvale, California, on January 29th at age 92. Janet Ann Graham Hunt was an American lawyer from Utah who served as state attorney general from 1993 to 2001. Other than candidates for lieutenant governor running on a ticket with a male candidate, she is the only woman ever elected to statewide office in the state of Utah. She was the most recent Democrat to serve in a statewide elected position in Utah. She died on January 29th at age 74. Dolores Conchita Figueroa del Rivero Anderson, known professionally as Chita Rivera, was an American actress, singer, and dancer. Rivera received numerous accolades, including two Tony Awards, two Drama Desk Awards, and a Drama League Award. She died on January 30th at age 91. 
Terry Paul Beasley was an American professional football player who was a wide receiver for the San Francisco 49ers of the NFL. He played college football for the Auburn Tigers, earning unanimous All-American honors in 1971. He was selected by the 49ers in the first round of the 1972 NFL Draft with the 19th overall pick. He was inducted into the College Football Hall of Fame in 2002. He died on January 31st at age 73. Joseph Madison, alternatively known as the Black Eagle, or Madison, was an American radio talk show host and activist heard daily on Cirrus XM Urban View. He died on January 31st at age 74. Michael David Martin Sr. was an American head baseball coach of the Florida State Seminoles baseball team. Martin is the all-time winningest coach in the NCAA Division I college baseball. Upon the completion of his career, Martin had compiled a record of 2,029 wins, 736 losses, and four ties, over 40 seasons of collegiate coaching. He died on January 1st at age 79. That's a wrap for today. Don't forget to smash the thumbs up, share, and subscribe to the channel to see our latest content.